They, the robots, work day and night and don't ask for any pay in return. Robots could ensure the survival of Swiss manufacturing, a sector weighed down by high labor costs. That's the case of the company Agerter, which specializes in precision mechanics. Robots are taking over more and more of the company's assembly line tasks. We began with a single robot with just one articulated arm. Now we're on the way to automating the whole production line. Paro, on the other hand, a firm that produces automated assembly systems, is one company that has benefited from the growing trend towards automation. Two large orders alone were worth 4 million francs to the company, enabling it to balance its books. Paro had been forecasting heavy losses due to the jump in the value of the Swiss franc one and a half years ago. Chief Executive Martin Frauenfelder sees automation as an insurance policy for his company. If we want to maintain a manufacturing sector in Switzerland, under the current conditions, and be successful at it, we need to invest in automation. Another company benefiting from the trend is Blaser. It produces lubricants and coolants. Clients have new demands. Automated machinery often run continuously, therefore they need the right kind of coolants. Coolants used in automation must work round the clock like the machines. That's why there's been an increase in requests. In general, we've seen considerable growth in demand.